Hello, hello everyone. Warm welcome back. I am super excited for today's video because it is harvest day. So I'm going around the garden harvesting a bunch of green, leafy green vegetables. And the reason why I'm sharing this with you is so that you can be inspired to grow a garden. You can see what is possible. It's June in Houston, June the 24th in Houston zone 9A where my garden is, where I grow a bunch of African vegetables, vegetables that are indigenous or maybe of African origin. That's what I try to do here. And whatever lessons that I learn as I figure out how to, you know, push the zone and grow these things outside of the tropics, I share them on this channel. So if you're new to the channel, I hope you consider subscribing so that you can be inspired, motivated, and you can learn how to successfully grow some of these greens. Thank you all so much for your encouragement and your support. These are greens, the Cameroon type of greens, the regular Amaran. We are harvesting some Amaran. regular African type of amaranth and then this is Jamaican amaranth known as Kalalu. Two very similar but very different types of vegetables. So these are water leaves. Water leaf, the water leaf vegetable. The best time to harvest would be right around now when the stems you know are thick like this maybe they have started to flower you can harvest before they flower but um yeah Now let's have it some bitter leaves. That's your bitter leaves. I'll show you how to harvest bitter leaves. Always cut the stems. I'm going to cut the stem away from a node. So this is where a new shoot is going to come from. So right here is where a new shoot is going to come from. So when, when harvesting, I'm gonna cut the stem like away from the node as far away as possible. So I'm going to go as low as possible and then as far away from the node as possible to harvest. These are all bitter leaves along the fence. This one right here and all the way. So let's get harvesting.
now let's have some peppers. The peppers are hiding on the meat. All of these my container okra tribe this is my ewedu that is the egyptian spinach in cameroon we refer to this as kren kren i think it's ready for harvesting it's probably <laughs> more than ready for harvesting according to what i have read because it's my first time growing ewedu you're supposed to start harvesting when it's about two feet tall this particular one is almost four feet tall already i have just a few of them a couple of them in the garden a couple of them yeah this i should have harvested when it was like this tall so that's another way do there that's the egyptian spinach is it molo molokai it has another name anyway i got the seeds from true love seeds i'm going to put a link in the description box in case you're looking for it it is a very nutritious vegetable rich in vitamins it is mucilaginous just like okra is we are harvesting the lego spinach this is the green one so from the last harvest we had several wait we have it the next one you should <laughs> on the last color you have five last well, last harvest was one yeah then now five five so we have a said wow look at that look at how fresh this is goodness our lego spinach harvest see how fresh it is fresh lego spinach what do you cook with this one a for hello guys it's harvest day i am going to be harvesting some jaman jama that's the garden huckleberry today this should be around the fourth or fifth harvest today is june the 18th you can see the jaman jama is starting to produce flowers and soon it will go to seeds but these are mature jaman jama the garden huckleberry i have several beds and i am going to be harvesting today and here is my harvest 